Welcome along to another YouTube tutorial. This is a song called No One Is To Blame by Howard Jones, a, um, a song from the 80s. There's a lot of good YouTube tutorials on how to play this um, note perfect. Uh, my YouTube tutorial is about making it as easy as possible for beginners and intermediate uh, piano players like myself. Um, and I get the, the chords and I transpose them and then so I give it to you in chord form. Um, now the first chord we're going to start with is a C chord. For me I play um, two C's in the left hand, an octave apart. If you want to just play one finger, you can do it that way. Uh, the right, my preferred C is actually this inverted C, which starts with a, a G, C, and an E. And the intro starts off rolling through that C, but we're gonna move our pinky up a little bit. So, G, F, E, and then just play a high F. My high F is, I don't go an octave apart, I go five notes apart for the F. I find you can get closer on the F, has a nicer sound. F and a C, and on the right, I've got an A, a C, and an F. And then we're gonna move up to the G, just move, slide both fingers up, and we're gonna keep our fingers locked in this position, because we're gonna go, so G, D, A, C, B, and then we're gonna go to our C note. And it's up to you how you use the foot pedal to give it that sort of static sort of jump between notes. So that those still for the intro. Now we'll go straight into the verse, which starts with a C. You can look at the menu, but you just can't eat. Now it's from C to G. I have a habit of just playing my G's. Um, so this is a G triad. G, B, and uh, D, but I tend to play the, the G, the C, and the D, and then come, move down to that. I just like the sound of moving down to that. But anyway, you can just go from the C to G if you like. But you just can eat up to the high F. You can feel the cushion, but you can't have a seat. You can dip your foot in the pool, but you can't have a swim. You can feel the punishment, but you can't commit the sin. Um, so I'm going down the line here. You don't need to do that. You can actually go, look at the menu, but you just can eat. Down to the F. You can feel the cushion, but you can't have a seat. So you can just jump straight from the F to the C, but I like rolling. It's a bit tricky with the rhythm, but it sounds nicer. And the way you do it is you, you basically, in the left, we're going to go the F, then we're going to go down to octaves. Octave 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 so we're going to go from f to e to d to c on the right the right hands it's not really that much of a a big deal because we're going to go from that f down to c back to f back to c so it's got that sound it sounds like you're going down the line there and that is the verse um so the chorus pretty simple and you want her you want you we want everyone and you want her and she wants you so again down the line we're doing that but now it's going to go up and down a bit no one back up no one down to the d minor seven no one ever is to blame And that's pretty much the whole song. There is uh, a bit at the end, I think, when we're out at the final um, chorus. Um, no one, no. And you want to, I have to go the whole way through. And you want to, okay. No one, no one, no one ever is to not back to the C this time, up to the A minor is to blame. Up to the D, then back to that D minor seven. No one ever is to blame. So there you go, pretty simple song, pretty simple chords. It's about mucking around with the rhythm and, and getting that up and down bit right if you want to use that. So I hope you enjoy it.